back there we have the video. Sorry about the echo. In other words, let's get it. Wait, 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 let me get this straight. You remember your fight with Brooklyn when we were in high school taking place in a WWE arena with a ring sold out crowd and commentators? The guy who can't remember the safe combination is questioning my memory? No, the guy who can't remember the safe combination is questioning your sanity. Whatever. I may have taken a few liberties with my story, but that is how I choose to remember it. Well, as much as I'd love to join you in rewriting history, that day is scorched into my brain because that's how I got my nickname, Trey. This is how it really went down. Get my own action figure, become WWE Divas Champion. Is this some kind of WWE nerd vision board? Hey, being immortalized in semi-posable plastic is the greatest thing a human being can achieve. Don't ever touch our stuff again. What, like this? <gasps> that was a huge mistake. Oh no, I've unleashed Hothead Red. I'm gonna take that marker, bring it to your grandmother's nursing home and cross out parts of her chart so when the nurse goes to give her turndown service, she won't know to flip her over. That's right, I'm gonna give your grandmother bed sores. What is wrong with you? Calm down, deep breaths, maybe we can talk this out. I'm done talking. <laughs> this is what happens when you mess with the captain of the wrestling team. What are you gonna do? Hit me with a steel chair? Put me through a table. I'm going to get help. <laughs> Everyone already knows Hothead Red, but let me introduce you to her best friend, Trey. Get it? Because he busted his butt on a lunch tray. <laughs> That could have been way worse. Yeah. Brooklyn could have posted a video of the whole thing online. Oh, wait. That's exactly what she did. I meant she could have dumped something worse on me, like mayo or hot sauce. And hey, at least she didn't destroy our list. So what? I'm not going to do any of those things anyway. What do you mean? We were just embarrassed in front of the entire school and currently 672 people on the Internet. I bet a bunch of those are repeat views. Great. We're not even touching on the fact that I got beat up by a lunch tray. I'm never going to be a WWE superstar. I'll just go to college and get a lame job like my parents want me to. <sighs> I think you need to read the letter again. Yes. See? This is what I'm talking about. I can't even open my locker. What's your combination? 16339, I think. Letter, please. Here we go. I think this section is relevant right now. 
You've probably asked yourself a million times, why? Why didn't they want to be my parents? The truth is we did, but we had to make the hardest decision of our lives because we didn't feel we could give you the life you deserved. And that life is one where you can have the freedom to follow your dreams no matter what they might be, to become anything you want. Using the only letter I have from my real parents as some sort of motivational speech is kind of a cheap move. They're right, though. You got a second chance in life, and you need to make the most of it. So why sell yourself short? You need to at least try. Fine. But when this whole WWE thing doesn't work out, I'm blaming you. It'll work out. I promise. Assuming you never have to wrestle a lunch tray. They're actually a lot tougher than they look. Okay, so maybe my memory of that day is a little off. Severe emotional trauma will do that. <laughs> but did I really say all that stuff about her grandmother? Yep. You had some serious rage issues back then. Did you also forget that's how you got your nickname because you were always seeing red? No, I remember. And then Brooklyn tacked on the hot head part. <laughs> Gotta give her credit for that. You know, the rhyming definitely made it catchier. Hot head red, hot head red, hot head red. Okay, okay, we get it. Have you figured out that's safe yet? <sighs> no, but I'm pretty sure I use the same combination I've always used for everything, which is... Got it. Finally. Was never in doubt. I'm sorry you were locked in there all alone for so long. Mommy won't ever let that happen again. There's something seriously wrong with you. You're just jealous. We should get going. We can't be late. Hey, we got a message from President Johnson. Do you think you impressed the most electrifying president in United States history with all your career achievements? Actually, you do. All the best on your big day. I'll be watching from the People's White House. That's cool. <laughs> but I, I voted for Kane. That's the big bro. I still can't believe it's really all over for you and Red. I know. It is starting to sink in, Just though. this morning, I was thinking about that time we faced each other in a false count anywhere. Yeah. But thanks to you in that match, now every time my jaw hurts, I know it's going to rain. Really? Maybe you should get that checked out. No way. You might be the champ. Yeah, that doesn't... Hey, pull that match up on your...
I spoke to Trey and AJ before this match, and both men admitted they didn't have a lot of experience in Falls Count Anywhere matches. Taking that into consideration, Trey did tell me he used a rather unusual training method to prepare for tonight. He played hours and hours of Falls Count Anywhere matches on WWE 2K. Yeah, because nothing will prepare you for one of the most brutal matches of your career. Not like sitting on a couch playing video games all day and night. What an idiot. The dangers in this kind of match are endless. Byron, what could we expect in this one? It's all about the dangers of the unknown. The fight could go anywhere. An attack can come from anywhere. Well, this is when we see just how far someone's willing to go to defeat their opponent. Because anything goes. He is efficient and dangerous with his offense thus far. He's definitely tapped a power source. Oh, wow. oh no, this isn't going to end well. AJ Styles beginning to look a little tired. Unfamiliar sight. Yeah, he needs to make an adjustment here. Oh, again! Guys, the most important thing for a superstar to remember in a Falls Count Anywhere match is that anything goes. And I do mean anything. I hope someone uses you as a weapon, Saxton. What an elbow drop! He only got one. He evades the attack. Here it comes. Make your last shot count. AJ's in big trouble now. AJ Styles. AJ Styles with a nice reversal. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. And it looks like this one's going out to the floor. That's unique, Corey. Bang right in the face. <laughs> what a forearm. the face Ooh. headbutt on oh, the back of the neck oh the reversal by AJ Styles not again. One of these competitors is eventually going to have to gain the upper hand. This has been a colossal battle to this point. No superstar is showing signs of backing down. We are seeing all their best on display, but it might just come down to who can take advantage of a pivotal mistake. Oh, man, what a strike! That'll hinder your modeling career. Oh, geez, that could take you out. Between the eyes. Hurt them. DDT. Really just laying it in. That's how you wear down your opponent. Styles is taking it to another level. Styles looks like he wants to do it all by himself. Anticipated that attack perfectly. Make your last shot count. Will he be able to capitalize? Back to the well with even more reward. Uh-oh. 
continuing the assault on his head here. Yeah, he might be seeing stars, Mike. Look at it in here. This could be it. Continue. I'm not sure that's a good thing. Now that's an eye-opening victory. I'm not impressed at all by it. Can't stop, won't stop, get guap. Ten white toes and them soy flip-flops. Manicures and pedicures, I'm always tip-top. When they say I'm not hot, all these lies need to stop. Cause I'm icy, wifey. Haters wanna fight me. Never been the one get RP up on a wifey. Keep my hands clean, got some hitters moving shicey. Ask me if I'm on them with some Gucci, but I might be. It's very unlikely. My wrist ain't looking icy. Charging by the minute. Is very pricey. Yeah, I be where the boss would be, charging for my vibe. You can feel it in my energy, stacking paper steadily so I can live in luxury. Looking in the mirror, I think I feel what I'm. I just wanted to congratulate you, Red. You really deserve it. Thanks, Natty. I know we had some differences. Yeah, except that one. <laughs> I didn't. Oh, yeah. The usual stuff. That's right. Now I remember. have clearly gotten personal between Red and Natalia. This is on Red for claiming she was the best female superstar to ever come out of Calgary. That was pretty much a direct shot at Natty. Natalia is certainly proud of her legacy and will go to any lengths to defend it. Had it scouted. Look out here. Backdrop suplex. Producing a trampling. Changes her fortune there. Back body drop. Uh. Ooh, bullseye. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> And now she gets her for a second time. Third time's a charm, Cole. Remember that as this match goes on. She just keeps using that. Hey, wouldn't you? Oh, nasty impact. Oh, saw it coming. And another reversal. Seems like we're back where we began, Michael. Natalia is a superstar who knows how to go the distance, weather the storm, and tough it out. She isn't someone to overlook. No one's saying Natalia is being overlooked, but she can sometimes get caught up in playing to the WWE universe. Uh. All it takes is one taunt too many, and her opponent could get the advantage over her. Natalia may be a veteran, but once her strategy flies out the window, she scrambles. She's made her point and can now admire her handiwork. 